Today we would like to show you the operation of the Magic TH2 Plus telephone hybrid. Here you can see the Windows PC software via which the system is configured and operated. We see the two available caller lines, number one and number two. If we are getting an incoming call, the respective caller line is blinking in yellow. If the caller is not yet in the database, we can see the telephone number if it is transmitted. To have a conversation with the caller before switching him or her to on air, we can accept the call on pre-talk. If we are using an external telephone in the POTS operating mode for pre-talk, we do not have to use the pre-talk button, but we simply use the external telephone to accept the call. In pre-talk we can now screen the caller, that means we can enter information of the caller such as name, first name and some more information about the caller in the info field. We can use this button to define the gender of the caller, male or female. And here we can um, use the smileys to set the mood or the quality of the caller. And via this button is also possible to block the caller. If a caller is blocked, he will not be put through and he will simply hear the busy tone and be rejected by the system automatically. Now that we have entered the details, um, our caller is saved automatically in our database. Via this little arrow we can adjust the caller's level. or we can use the automatic gain control to adjust it automatically. To switch the AGC off again, we simply press the button again. Here we can also see the received and the transmitted audio signal. We also have a waiting position. We can switch the caller to hold where he listens to the on-air signal or a recorded hold signal or also an external hold signal can be used. This depends uh, what you have entered in your configuration. To switch the caller live to on-air we simply press the on-air button. Um, if we have another caller on line 2 we can either have an on-air conference by switching both callers to on-air. This will be done if you have selected one fader mode in your configuration. And this means you have a conference between both callers and they are available at one audio output. Or if you have selected the two fader mode in your configuration, each caller will be available at a separate audio output. The R button is the call forwarding button. With this you can forward the call to another telephone number. This is more or less the call forwarding function which you know from your standard office telephone. To drop the caller, simply press the drop button. Of course it is also possible to make an outgoing call. This can be done either by pressing pre-talk, hold or on air on a free line of the telephone hybrid or you can also use the external telephone to make an outgoing call. Alternatively you can also simply open the telephone book here you have the chance to make a manual call, so you enter the telephone number manually. We have a redialing button. 
or you can search the telephone book for a number or of course also for a name. To dial out you simply select the desired number and the outgoing call will be established. Via the telephone book you can also make a new entry or you can edit an existing entry. Of course, if required, you can also delete entries. A few more functions which are available uh, for the Magic TH2 Plus are the lock all function. With this you can lock all lines, so no incoming calls are allowed and callers who try to call on the system will only hear the busy tone. To unlock the lines, simply press the button again. It is also possible to lock single lines, just press the drop button a little bit longer. You can also drop all calls um, simultaneously with the drop all button. For security reasons, um, we have here to confirm that we really want to drop all lines. Also important is the list functionality, which we can open via show lists. Here we can see all our last calls. Um, we see the incoming and the outgoing calls, which are marked via the respective arrow. We see the name of the caller if he's in the database, the telephone number, the date of the call, the time and the duration. With the filter function you can filter the display of the last calls. We have some predefined filters such as yesterday, last 7 days, last 30 days, meaning going back from today or last calendar week, last calendar month. Of course, you can also define your own filters. Here you can enter a date and a time and by pressing custom range you will see the filtered entries. If you don't want to have a filter, press no filter. It is possible to adjust the resolution of the Windows PC software so you can also adjust the size so that you have the last calls next to your operating software always opened or if you didn't, don't need it open all the time you can close it and just open it when it's required. The last function which I want to show is the night service function. The night service have to be configured first in your uh, settings of the Magic TH2 Plus. And with the night service calls can be accepted automatically by the system and forwarded to a predefined number. This can be for example your answering machine and you can use the night service when the studio is um, unmanned during the night but it is still in operation then the telephone hybrid will accept the calls automatically and forward the calls to the number which you have entered in the configuration. To switch it off again press switch off. Maybe one last function um, it is also possible to select presets so if your uh, administrator has configured presets for several uh, shows for example a one fader preset and a two faders preset you can easily select it via select preset. Also interesting is probably the little PC online symbol if it says PC Online and it is green, the connection between the PC software and your 
TH2 plus is OK and working. If it says PC offline and it is red, please check the control interface settings. With a double click you can open the system monitor where you have information about system and application alarms. These were the main uh, functions and operation possibilities for the MAGIC TH2+. More information, especially on the configuration, you will find on our website www.avt-nbg.de in the section Support Quick Guides and here you can download the MAGIC TH2 Plus Quick Guide.